Hey, this is Hurdyberg with Hurdyberg.com, and it's time to get your geek on. Hey, I always get a lot of questions about music with your videos online. Uh, and let me give you some basic rules for that because there are some things like some embarrassing legal fees or maybe some lawsuits. So this will be a good time to introduce you to what you need to do in order to make sure that what you're playing on your videos and sharing on your social sites is allowed and is legal. Okay? So, uh, first of all, um, there's three basic rules that I like you to follow, and I'm not an attorney, um, and I don't give legal advice, so if you do have some deeper questions about um, music on top of your videos that you've produced, um, you know, there's some good attorneys out there that can help you online. But I'm going to give you three rules to help you out today. The first one is, is that before you can put any music, so let's just make it a blanket deal, any music, you need to have written permission from the copyright owner of that music before you can add it to your video. They own that and they're allowed to um, dictate how they want their music used and for you to use it commercially uh, or put it up there for a bunch of people to see it and, and benefit from it, um, you need to have their permission. And I would go in a little bit further and say that I wouldn't add any music to any video unless I had written permission from the actual copyright owner. In some cases that's the record label and in other cases sometimes it's an agency that's bought copyright material and you need to just make sure, you need to do your research, find out who owns copyright to certain pieces of music and then you need to ask the proper permission and generally they'll ask for your description of the video and what's going to go on it and what you're going to do on it, okay? so. Um, don't add any music to any videos for whatever reason unless you have that written permission in writing from the copyright owner. Alright, now let's say you uh, just did a video uh, and you upload it to, to Google, right? And, uh, well, there is a thing called audio swap. Um, you upload it to your YouTube channel, you go to your upload list where your page of all your video is, and you can do a thing called audio swap, which is legal. And audio swap means that you um, uh, go through a process that it stair steps you through it where you can pick a song off the playlist on the audio swap and then add it to your video. And that's perfectly legal and perfect fine. I'm pretty sure a lot of people do this. However, uh, make sure you pick out a song that matches up the length of your video and realize that that's permanent. Okay? So, basic rule of thumb. Don't add any music to any videos unless you have permission. A lot of people today will go out and find indie artists or those new and upcoming bands that are still developing their music and are more than happy to let you use some of their tracks and things uh, that they're trying to get out there to the public. And I have found that the unsigned artist where you can go directly to and work directly with is a great place to get your music because they want their music to be heard. They want it to get out there, but you still need to get written permission from them. And you need to tell them what you're doing with it. There's also a lot of music sites that claim to give you a license to play music with your videos, and that's true. But in a lot of cases, there might be a little piece of uh, lineage at the bottom, that little small sprint stuff you know, we always see that says, hey, you can use this for your own purpose on your own videos but you can't use it for commercial use. So you need to be real careful before you go out and buy licensed music to make sure what it can, look at their terms of use and make sure what it can be used for. So this is Hurdy and I just want to review with you what I just told you. Don't add any music to any videos without written permission from the copyright owner, the record label, or the agency that owns that music. You can use audio swap on Google on the YouTube site. That is perfectly legal and fine. It is permanent once you do that, and you have to do that up on the YouTube channel. All right? Outside of that, to be safe and not sorry, always get written permission before you put any music up on your videos. And the myth about, well, if I give the artist credit and their website and everything on my video, eh, that means nothing. That's a myth going around the internet that if you put up their name and, and their website, they're really happy. That is not true. That does not save you from embarrassing legal fees or possible lawsuit. No music on your videos without written permission from the copyright owner. You put that rule in your head and you'll be safe and not sorry. 
This is Ferdy Burke with FerdyBurke.com. Get your geek on.